Good morning, students and staff. This is our loyal news session once again for uh, Friday, January 11th. We are once again going to start with Myers Meteorology and then right after that, Moose Reviews. So starting with Myers Meteorology. To you, Meyer. Thank you, Vaughn. Now for your Friday radar. We have winds coming from the north. So you might want some sweaters to wear that day, maybe jackets, whatever you want to wear, gloves, hats, I, I don't care. Now for your four-day forecast. Friday is supposed to be partly sunny, 24 in the high and 10 in the low. Saturday is also partly sunny, 33 in the high and 26 in the low. Sunday is cloudy, 35 in the high and 33 in the low. Monday is going to be a pretty bad day. It's going to be a rainy day, 60% chance of rain, and a 38 in the high and 33 in the low. You definitely might want to have some umbrellas, I maybe a rain jacket, rain boots. I don't know if that's a thing. It sounds like it's a thing. I don't know. Or just don't go outside. That works too. That's it. Thank you. Thank you, Meyer. And now for our quick commercial break. Do you have trouble sleeping at night? Are normal sleep aids not working for you? Are you tired and realize it's almost nine? Well then you should try the new Frying Pan 3000. Having trouble sleeping? You should try this. Seriously? Ever since I used the frying pan 3000, I've slept really great. Take it from Meyer. If you want a frying pan 3000, you can get one now for just 10 payments of $79.99. And if you order now from the number on the bottom of the screen, you'll get a second one completely free with the low price of $20. Man, I even tried the frying pan 3000 myself and I am sleeping so good like i'm just saying i want to pick yours up so yeah now for moose reviews thank you vaughn what's up guys welcome back to moose reviews instead of the usual review today we got some news for you so let's get into it Start with some video game news. Sony has just announced their release date for their brand new PlayStation VR 2, which is releasing right along Horizon Zero Dawn VR. That's going to be February 22nd. Next, for Xbox, they announced their brand new E3 style game showcase, which will be happening the 25th of January. It's going to be including some big announcements, including release date for Starfield. Forza Motorsport and Minecraft Legends. Avatar Way of the Water still remains at number one in the box offices for the fourth consecutive weekend in a row. Don't know how they did that. In other news from Hollywood, actor Jeremy Renner spends his 52nd birthday in the hospital while recovering from his horrific snow plowing accident over the New Year's weekend. His fan, he still. He is thanking his fans for all of the support through these tough times. That's it for this week. Now back to you, Vaughn. Thank you, Moo. And now for your Friday morning announcements. The FCC LA is hosting an ice cream sale today during Git. So basically right now, if you're watching it right now during Git, to raise funds for their splash pad, your teachers will get a call to release you to get some. It's a dollar scoop, and they have four flavors. I might have to get some. There is a girls' basketball game, and it's at home against Gilman. Varsity, there's only a varsity game at 6.30. This is so early. I don't know. On the 14th of January, we have a wrestling tournament at Stevens Point Invitational at 9 a.m. 
and a middle school wrestling tournament at Wausau West Invitational at 10 a.m. The Greenwood Booster Club has extended an invitation to their annual chili feed to be held on Thursday, January 19th from 3.30 to 7.30 p.m. The cost will be $7 for adults and $3 for little kids. The Loyal vs. Greenwood girls basketball game will be hosted at Greenwood that night. Loyal District Spelling Bee will be on Tuesday, January 17th, 1.30 p.m. Good luck, spellers. We have several lunch and learn opportunities available this month. Ag architecture and construction from 12 to 12.40 on Wednesday, January 18th. Might want to give that a try. If you are interested in learning more about architecture and construction, please stop by Mrs. Shear's room. The high school FCA will be meeting on Thursday, January 19th during GIT, and the middle school will be meeting on January 26th during GIT. There will be sweet treats to share at both meetings. That means donuts, so... I know where I'm going. There are going to be some parent-teacher conferences held on January 19th from 3.30 to 7 p.m. Parents will find an online registration to secure a specific time to see a teacher. Parents with students in grades eight, 6 to 12 are welcome to come without an appointment. The 41st annual FFA Alumni Bowling Tournament will be held at Strike Time Lanes in Nilsville, January 27th through the 29th. Join in the fun by registering your team with Mark Gregorich. There is more information in the high school office as well as through Mrs. Donnerbauer. Here it is. The best time of the video. The morning mindset. If your dreams do not scare you, they are not big enough. Just think about that. And for lunch today, you have Philly cheesesteak. So if you want to get that, you can. Have a fortuitous Friday. And now to Meyer with the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.